so hi friends this is amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video so we are done with the fab attempt of j2021 so i am here with the category wise cutoff for each shift that is first and second shift of 24 25 and 26 so all the shift cutoff marks i will discuss here that is category wise so whether you are from any category this video is for you and this video is especially for the student who have appeared for the fab attempt but if you don't appear then also you can take this information for the next attempt also so in this video i will give a detailed analysis of cutoff marks what you need to score uh, to get the cutoff clear for the each shift of the fab attempt so here you will get the accurate cutoff so if you are first to my channel please subscribe it you will get all the uh, future video also on this channel and all the informative video and update you will get the, at the right time and in in the next video i will cover the similar type of uh, analysis for the marks versus percentile for each and every uh, and you will and uh, you will also get your category rank in that video so stay tuned for uh, with this channel you will get all the video in future also and also i request you again please subscribe this channel and uh, share this video to your friends so that they can also get this information and i have already uploaded around 200 video on this channel so you can check whichever video you like uh, you want the information you can check all those video you will get very good information in ev uh, in my every video so try to check uh, check that in free time you will get very informative information in that all the videos so let's start the video so before starting i request you again please subscribe as i am close to two, uh, 2000 subscribers so if you support i will get there soon so try to support me also i will always provide you the guide and support throughout the counseling so you can also contact me through comment section or on my instagram also i will get i will provide the link in the description or you will get the user id also so let's start the video so friends there is a request please subscribe this channel for comedy content this is my friend's channel you will get the link in the description box so first of all i will talk about the cutoff percentile what you need to a score uh, so as to get the uh, cutoff clear for each and every category so the percentile will remain same for each and each, uh, each and every shift but the marks will differ uh, for each shift how much marks you need to score to get that percentile so in this video you will get all those information so category wise percentile required for cutoff clear is for general you can expect it around 91 to 92 percentile because last year it was 90 point something but this year the number of our student got increased so as the seat also increased so percentile cutoff percentile depend on the number of a student and as well as the number of seats available in the uh, nit triple, triple it or iits so, uh, sorry so number uh, of seat in the uh, iits so the seat increment is not so much uh, as the um, number of a student increase this year so the cutoff will rise uh, one or two percentiles so for general it is 91 to 92 percentile and for obc it is 72 to 75 percentile and later in this video you will get how much marks you need to a uh, score to get this percentile for each shift that is all the six shift of j2020 fab attempt so for ews it is around 71 to 74 percentile and sc 50 to 55 percentile and for st it is 40 to 45 percentile so one more thing i would like to clear here that if you get th this percentile in the fab attempt that is uh, after the result you will get the information so don't worry you will get the clear cutoff no matter how much you score in the uh, next attempt of the je also if you score less matter because your best will be considered for the cutoff clearance so this is all about the cutoff that is percentile you need to score now i will talk about the marks for each shift you need to score to get this percentile so here is the cutoff marks for fab 24 shift 1 and shift 2 so both the shift will be covered in this slide uh, so here is the for general if you are uh, uh, general and if you, if your exam was in shift 1 of 24 then you need to score 90 to 95 marks to clear the cutoff as i got the information through the anal after analyzing the uh, paper of the shift 1 so uh, for shift 2 82 88 to 93 marks you need to score because the shift 2, two paper was slightly uh, difficult than the first uh, 
so for obc shift 1 80 to 85 and for shift 2 78 to 83 so for ews candidate 79 to 84 and 77 to 82 marks for shift 2 so for sc 50 to 55 and for shift 2 48 to 53 marks you need to score to clear the cutoff so for ST it is 50, uh, 45 to 50 and for SIP 2 43 to 48. So this is all about the cutoff marks you need to uh, score for FAB uh, SIP 1 uh, sorry FAB 24 SIP 1 and SIP 2. So uh, as you all know the progressively day by day the, the difficulty level of the paper got increased. So as you need to uh, score less marks if you are from 25 or 26. So I will consider that now. So the cutoff marks for FAB 25, SIP 1 and SIP 2 is here. For general 87 to 92 marks you need to score for SIP 1 and for SIP 2 85 to 90 marks. And for OBC 77 to 82 and SIP 2 75 to 80. I am giving a range of marks because it is uh, not possible to predict the exact marks uh, for the cutoff because it may vary 4 5 marks up and down. So I am giving you a range of marks in which if you are falling then you are safe, you are, uh, you, you will clear the cutoff easily. So for EWS 76 to 81 and for SIP 2 74 to 79. So, uh, so if you are from general or any other category so it's not all about clearing the cutoff but if you if your JE advanced preparation is very good then you can think you can uh, do the cutoff clear and then you can do your uh, best in the J advanced exam but if you think about NIT, triple IT, GFTI then you need to uh, score many more than the cutoff so as to get a good triple uh, IT, GFTI or NIT uh, so uh, uh, unless and until you are a reserved, uh, reserved student that is SCST student uh, and you are uh, a student of home state of a lower triple IT, GFTI, NITs because lower GFTI, triple IT or NIT will will be available for low marks also especially for the home state student uh, so if you clear the cutoff you can easily get those triple uh, it gfti and it and for uh, getting the uh, information of that you can check the i button as well as in the description box you will get the information how much marks you need to score uh, so as to get the triple uh, it gfti or nit so average uh, average nit good nit and lower NIT all type of uh, discussion has been uh, there in that video so you can check uh, there are three video for each for uh, NIT, GFTI, Triple IT you can check all those video and also you can check the video that is marks versus percentile versus your category rank in that video you will get an overall idea of how much will be your category rank if you uh, score a particular percentile or par particular marks so check all those video in the i button as well as in the description box so let's continue the video so for SC 47 to 55, uh, 52 and for SIP 2 uh, 45 to 50 marks you need to score and for ST it is 42 to 47 for SIP 1 and for SIP 2 40 to 45 so this is all about the cutoff marks for FAB 25 SIP 1 and SIP 2 so one more thing I would like to remind you so once again I would like to remind you the next video I will upload about the marks versus percentile for each shift like this also so in that video i will uh, discuss on how much marks you will get how much percentile so stay tuned with this channel and please subscribe so that you will get that video also so now cutoff marks for fab 26 shift 1 and shift 2 so here is the cutoff for general for shift 1 84 to 88 and shift 2 80 to 85 as the difficulty level of the paper day by day progressively become tougher so the cutoff marks has been decreased from shift 1 of 24 to shift 1 of 26 as you can also see uh, and uh, opt uh, for obc it is 74 to 78 marks and for shift 2 70 to 75 marks and for ews 73 to 77 and for shift 2 69 to 74 so there is around 4 to uh, 5 lakh of around 4 or 4.2 uh, lakh a student uh, who belong from OBC and uh, for EWS uh, it is 1, 1 to 1 1.5 lakh around uh, so that makes the percentile decrease for that category uh, and, uh, rather for general the number of a student is more so for general the cutoff go higher uh, 
then the OBC or EWS candidate. Uh, so for e S3 44 to 48 and for SIP 2 40 to 45 marks you need to score to clear the cutoff. For ST it is SIP, uh, for SIP 1 38 to 8, no, 43 and for SIP 2 35 to 40. So this is the list marks you need to score at least to get the clear cutoff for ST that is 35 to 40 marks for SIP 2 of the 26th FAB attempt. So this is all about the cutoff marks shift wise. So hope you find this video useful and I'm sure you will get the much needed information in this video. So try to like this video, share this video and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe this channel. You will get further videos also. So thanks for watching the video.